Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I've got a unboxing of sorts. This is a diamond painting that I picked up at Joann's the other day. Um, I was over there and just decided to see what they had in store. And I love wolves, so I had to get this. Um, it is a round and it actually shows on the box what it looks like. It even shows, I guess, how the drills are going to come out, like the rendering and everything, which is really cool. Um, so it looks like the details will be really nice on this one. That is, if this is accurate. Um, it's a 42 by 47 centimeter. Uh, let's see. It says it's intermediate. It's called Muzzle Nuzzle, and this is one of the diamond dots. Add some sparkle to your world. So it says all-inclusive diamond facet art kit. So let's take a look inside and see what it looks like. I haven't even broken the seal yet, so let's go ahead and do that. It's got some, it's got some tape on here. So let's get into it, take a look. And this is going to be the first uh, diamond painting that I've gotten from Diamond Dots. Actually, I got my son one while I was there too. I got him a Spider Man, and his is a partial. Ooh, I like that. It says, add some sparkle to your world. Right there. You can read it right there. And let's see the diamonds, the drills, and the tools should be in here. Yep, that's everything that came in the box. <clears throat> oh, and here's like, there's a little picture of it right here to show what it's going to look like. So it is a complete complete design area. Isn't that cute? Look at them. That's why it's called Muzzle Nuzzle. I just thought it was precious. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and take a look. Let's see. I think these are sealed. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. I think I can open it from this end. I can already tell that the um, canvas feels really soft. Feels like fabric. Wow. That's different. So this actually feels like fabric. Look at that, guys. You can see, like, um, you can see the texture on the back. And it's got this little scalloped edge. Rolled really nice. And it is poured glue. We'll just take a look across the bottom here. Yeah, it even calls it fabric. It says fabric size is 50 by 55. And the design area is 42 by 47 centimeters. We have the legend on the side. Okay, and we've got we've got some instructions probably on the inside here. Yep, if I can figure out which way it goes. So we've got all the instructions here which I don't really need. This will actually be um, 
If I start it next, it'll be my fifth diamond painting ever. Oh, look at it, it's beautiful. Of course, there's some, a little bit of, um, you can see the wrinkles in the plastic, but I'm pretty sure that's just going to be the plastic that's doing that. And I apologize for the glare, but I do have some reflection on it, don't I? Wow, it is gorgeous. That is going to be really pretty because you can tell, I can already tell, just doesn't really look like it's very pixelated and it looks like the chart is really clear. Let's see if we can get a closer look for you. Some of the symbols. I may need to invest in a light pad because it does look like some of the darker symbols on these might be a little harder to read just because the symbols are black on a dark background. I wonder why they don't do like a white symbol on the dark backgrounds, on the dark colors. So yeah, these eyes are beautiful. Look at the eyes, if we can get it without a glare. I love the amber color. And there is um, a legend on the left side as well. And then it says diamond dots up in the left hand corner. So I'm going to go ahead and roll this back up. Wait, first let me check the stickiness. Just a tad. Oh, it's sticky. Yep. <laughs> and I want to just check as I peel it back to make sure. Yeah, it looks like... Um, like the little wrinkles that you see are just in the plastic. I'm going to go ahead and roll it back up. They had it folded a little bit like this and then rolled. So I am just going to go back to doing that the way it was. Put it back in its bag. Oh, and it's the bag that actually says add some sparkle to your world. That was printed on the bag. I thought maybe it was on the um, on the fabric, but it's not. Well, I mean, it was on the fabric as well, but they did put it there on the bag. So we've got we've got the uh, canvas back in the box. And let's take a look at some of these drills. I am going to sit next to you guys right here. <clears throat> well, let's see what it comes with because, like I said, I haven't done one of these before. I've only done um, three BTS cubic paintings, which are also diamond paintings. And I'm working on a mindfulness diamond painting, the quirky fox. He's my fourth one. And this will be my fifth. And they don't use the DMC codes. I do remember that because I was looking and I thought maybe these were three tens. They probably are kind of hard to see in this lighting right now. But um, it could be brown. My lighting, I'm losing light. Let's see what time it is. It's 4.30. But it's not that bright in here right now. I've just got a skylight and a front window that I'm using. The light. So these are 8001.
Well, we're just going to look through them really quick here. I forgot to turn the notifications off on my phone. So we keep hearing it ding. Turn them over so we can actually see the colors. That's a pretty gray. I like the light gray. It's really sparkly. I don't know if you guys can catch that on camera. Oh, and an even lighter gray. And then this looks almost brown. And we have one more, or two more, two more strings. Nope, they're cut apart, I guess. Four more strings of diamonds. Sorry if it's crinkling in your ears, guys. I do apologize. There aren't very many of these colors, so I hope that that's all I need. Because these are kind of sparse. And there's more of these. These are, this one's really full. <clears throat> oh, I know. These are probably the eyes. Remember I said that the eyes were amber, the am amber color? <clears throat> Should have brought a glass of water over here too and I forgot that. I was just not prepared. I really like these earth tones. Lots of neutrals. Neutral earth tones. Really pretty. Warm colors. I might have to start this one next. I know I keep saying that each time I open one, I've still got those four um, Diamond Art Club paintings to do too that came in the intro kit that I just got. But yeah, so those are the diamonds. And I didn't see any trash in them. They look really, really clean. Take a look at the little tool kit. Comes with the pen. So far I've gotten a pink one like this and a blue one. So now I've got a clear one to add to my collection. And this one actually came with um, A squishy to put on it. Let's see if that's going to be easy to get on there. Oh yeah, that feels much better than the way I've been doing them. I've been working without a squishy and I've done like four already. I'm on my fourth diamond painting without using a squishy and just using these little pens. But oh, that feels really nice. That's going to save my hands. <laughs> oh, and I like how it comes with some extra baggies, too. Because these are not, um, they're not in Ziploc bags, so I will have to kit these up. Came with extra bags for kitting, for kitting up. So far I've just worked out of plastic bags, so should be able to do that. It comes with its own little little jar. Reminds me of those Carmex jars. So cute. It's really cute. Pink wax. I'll have to test that out. And a little gray boat. So far I've got, well, I've got some green ones. Yep, so that's it guys. Um, this video wasn't very long. I just thought I would go ahead and get the kit open. 
because I hadn't opened it yet and I was waiting to do that with you guys. Let me take a look because I didn't see... Um... Oh, well the legend is on the canvas. So I was going to say I didn't see a legend anywhere else. I wonder if it's on the inside of this. Let's take a look really quick. I didn't open it. I don't think it is going to be in here. I think it's just on the canvas itself. Yeah, because this is just instructions in um, different languages. Oops, I'm holding it upside down. <laughs> So this was the instructions. And yeah, so um, I guess the legend is only on the canvas, which is fine. Uh, usually I've had, you know, a sheet that came with it that had the legend on it. But we don't really need that because we've got the legend on the canvas itself. But I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye, guys, and thank you for joining. I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing or opening, little box opening of my first ever Diamond Dots. And I can't wait to get started on it. I will probably do that on a video, let you guys watch as I get it going. And I will um, say goodbye for now, and I'll be back again next time with more to share for it with you guys. All right, I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you guys are staying safe out there and having a great week. Have a great weekend. I'll see you next time. Bye.